How's it going guys? So I did promise you a devotion guide for the um, shaman build, water build, sorry, that I uh, just posted. Rage of Ultos. So let's go see how to do this build, alright? Now this will be pretty simple. You can also go on uh, Roll Call's guide as well. Link is in the description, which is on the video as well all right so to start off uh you'll probably need about um 13 aether crystals in total uh, let's say if you did a build let's say if you built your um your devotion whatever you however you want it, and now you need to reset everything uh so you probably need about 13 of these um to do it properly the way I'm gonna do it uh, you'll probably need more so just make sure you farm a bit of extra crystals and let's start this off alright so first off you'll need to put one point into Ascendant if you don't know what Ascendant is you, uh, or the other names you can uh, look at the affinity name on the left hand side which is purple so one affinity is purple so you put one into purple bam so now we need to complete the empty throne so full points into empty throne okay and now we need to reclaim the Let me clear your mind. the uh, primordial right here the um, we need to reclaim the ascendant okay so let's just reclaim that perfect go back yeah it's gonna be lots of back and forth okay just to tell you guys but whatever uh, so we reclaim the ascendant now we put one point into primordial again if you don't know what primordial it is it is a blue one so you put one point into primordial bam all right you put all your points into eels so one here one here you can get a chance to see what it is at the same time okay so we put all three points into eel now we need to uh, reclaim our primordial point that's why I'm right beside this guy here okay so reclaimed go back <laughs> I know it's annoying um, then you put all your points into tempest which is here so one two three four five six and seven uh, I'll just put whatever my skill was but, uh, later on you put three points into scholars light which is right here so one two three afterwards you put full points into chariot of the dead one two three four five six seven get all points and uh, now you put one point into the eldrick and in crossroads so eldrick is the uh, green one so you put uh, one point into green Man, so at this point we want to get out and we want to reclaim all three points from Scholar's Light. So one, two, three. Perfect. So let's go back to our devotion and now we want to um, put one point into Chaos. Chaos is, the, uh, is red. And we want to put full points into Behemoth. In my, in my video, I forgot to mention that it's full points. I, um, for some reason, I said it wasn't full points. Which is my bad. Okay, my bad. So you don't put all points. Uh, after you put the Behemoth, you get out again. And you... Whoops, sorry. Get out again, and you reclaim both your Chaos and Eldrick. So bam, bam. Okay. So you reclaim both points. We go back okay and you're gonna put all your points into Wendigo all right we don't really care about the skill well, actually I know what my skill is gonna be so uh, where's my guys going by um, all points into Kraken right here so, if you wanted to see what it was it's 35% um, to all damage which is amazing again so look at that all damage all damage crit all damage love it um, so then afterwards you put one after cracking you put one point into order so if you don't know what order is order is the uh, yellow point so it is right here Good. and afterwards you put all your points into crane so it looks like this 
Okay. And afterwards you put three points into Lion. Excellent. At this point, we want to reclaim three points from Wendigo. Uh, so we have to do one, two, three. Okay. Stay strong. Go back. And we, at this point, we'll have enough points to go into all of these scales of Wakama. So we start here. Okay, scales of Wakama. And afterwards, we will reclaim three points from Lions. We need to go back to the trainer, take off three points, three. And at that point, we have enough points to complete our Wendigo once again. All right, so that's how you do the build, guys. Um, I know it looks simple, but you know, going back and forth, back and forth to do it uh, is a tad annoying, I know. Um, so yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, do check out uh, um, the build guide on the forms and as well of the uh, build video that I did for this devotion guide as well. Hope you enjoyed again. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. See you.